Louis C. the Mary checking in right now. What is going on, my people? Had the club going up on a Tuesday. Check it out. Come on in. Get them notifications on. We all the way live from the FloridaKeysInjury.com studios. Thank you all for tuning in. All love right now. I got uh, my girl, uh, Tangela Edwards. Make sure you all follow her on, on Facebook. Doing big things. So we're going to just go over couple little things happening, so please come on in. If you got a question, we are talking about what is really going on with getting uh, back open for tourism. So I had a lot of dialogue with some people, some of my colleagues, and obviously we cannot get into tourism unless we... Um, Louis C. the Mayor checking in right now. What is going on, my people? Got the club going up. We... Uh, we need to start with locals and make sure we uh, locals are straight down here. So Key West Big Pine Marathon, you're on the uh, Louis C. the Mayor podcast. Shout out to everybody tuning in. All love right now. So basically, that's what we're trying to get to. Um, when do we uh, open back up? When is it safe? Uh, you know, it's quiet as a pin drop. You know, business is slow, but business comes secondary to people's health. And we got to make sure that's taken care of. I want to shout out all my people in the entertainment business going to the struggle, anybody going to the struggle. So it's serious business out here. So only the true spirit of a hustler will survive on what's happened. So come on in. I see some people coming in. Uh, Pamela, I see you. Uh, let me see. Uh, Bobby, I see you. All love right now. Thank you all for uh, uh, tuning in on the, uh, on the live. And also check out my YouTube channel, okay? On the YouTube channel, we got all the podcasts going. So basically, if you got any questions today and you got any um, ideas or any suggestions or anything, or just, uh, you know, like I said, a question, then come on in and let me know. Shout out to Dr. Uh, Bruce uh, Burroughs, Advanced Urgent Care, Key West Marathon and Key Largo. That man got the... Oop. It's on the live right now, boy. This is on the live. It's all right, Tan. We're just going to do it raw right here. So uh, um, this is the live. That's why it's a live podcast. These things happen in, in, in studio sometimes. Look like a gunshot went off in here. It's all good, though. <laughs> so go ahead and uh, come on in, and we're going to talk about it and see what uh, we got going on. So shout out to, to everybody, uh, like I said, tuning in. Let me see what else we got in here. Let me see. Okay. Yeah, see, uh, thank you, Mark Lyons, for, uh, from FloridaKeysInjury.com. If you're in an accident, any type of accident on a moped or anything, on a bicycle, whatever accident you uh, you in, just uh, go to FloridaKeysInjury.com. They're going to uh, take good care of you. So what happened is let's get to the meats and potatoes here, okay? Make sure you all turn your notifications on so like that when we have a live, you guys can get notified. So I formed a group called Sin Key West, which is Service Industry Key West, okay? And the purpose of this group is we got the 2020 election. It's a presidential election coming up. And I want to get uh, people out there to vote. I want to have the biggest voter turnout in the history of Moreau County. And I want to get people voting uh, very strongly. I want to get up to 5,000 people. Some of y'all don't think voting is important. You vote or die. That's the best I can tell you. Vote or die. P. Diddy, uh, Diddy, if you're watching it, and Puff Daddy, Puff Daddy just raised like almost $5 million the other day on the Instagram uh, live. That was an incredible situation. That's why I get that slogan, voted that. So here are the members of the committee, okay? Um, I'm the chair of the committee. I got Dr. Bruce uh, Boros. I got that good old boy from Sugarloaf Principal Harry Russell. Demetrius Roach, uh, business owner, Stanley Steamer. And Key West High School basketball, Joe Long, okay? Uh, Joe is the owner of the Sandbar and Paradise Pizza. Uh, Joe Walsh, Joe Walsh got the whole thing on lock. He got about seven, eight different places. So thank you, uh, Mr. Walsh, for being part of the group. Uh, gentleman that's part of the ownership of the Sheraton Suites and the Havana Cabana, Milos Davovic. Okay, so that gentleman is uh, new to the community, so he's going to join me on the uh, committee, and we're going to uh, get some things done and talk about when 
it makes sense to open up for tourism. So if you got any ideas or anything, just let me know. Mikey Story in the building. What's up? What's up, killer? Michelle Marie, she's serious on that. Con Cuts doing it big, screaming 305 all day. Y'all come on in. Let's get it in. Kimberly, I see you. Uh, my man, let me see who else we got here. Stephanie. All love. Thank y'all for the love. It's all love in the in the club. Now, so these are the people uh, on the committee. So my question is to y'all, when should we open back up? Now, obviously, we're not going to open back up for tourism on, on the first day, right? And it's not going to open up tomorrow or the next day. We know that, right? Some people out here on the Facebook platform do not want to have any tourists in town anymore. Okay, so uh, I don't think that's going to work. I think we're going to have to have some type of tourism in town uh, because if not, the whole economy will collapse. Do y'all know I have people that are entertainers that perform that uh, haven't worked since March 17th on St. Patrick's Day and have to go on a Facebook Live platform like this so they can get donations to eat? It's fine if you're getting a check or you're getting overtime right now, but you know we got to get the city back open, man. We got to go back to where we uh, come from. And I think everybody's been doing a, a good job. So if you got an idea, um, you know, or um, when you think it'll be appropriate to open, you know, obviously it's going to be a situation where it's touch and go because we're still not rid of the COVID-19. You know, we got three deaths, you know, in Monroe County and so many deaths uh, worldwide and it's not over with yet. So we can't afford to basically be shut down for 18 months. So we got to figure some out. So when I have this meeting on Friday, I'm going to come back with some information and uh, see where we at. So if you got anything here, any questions you want to ask, this would be the time right now to ask them. Um, because like I said, I'm just trying to get a little feedback. Also, where's the party Key West and Latinos Cayo Hueso? Those sites are usually entertainment sites. They're wide open for you to uh, go ahead and uh, post anything that you want any health information. Uh, shout out to all my doctors and nurses and medical professionals. Uh, actually, if you're a doctor, nurse, or a health professional, uh, there's a event down here that we call Fantasy Fest uh, in 2020 in October. Uh, Louis C. the Mayor Entertainment has decided this year because of all the stuff that's been going on, if you are a doctor, nurse, or work in the health field, you get in free. All you have to do is show ID. You must be local, okay? So that's to uh, basically, you know, um, have people have some fun because they've been in the trenches. You know, never before did you go, you know, to the hospital and come out, you know, not alive because it's, it's so dangerous out there. So y'all keep doing what you're doing um, and basically stay positive. Check out my girl, uh, Tangela Edwards on Facebook. She's on production uh, with me. You know, this stuff over here, I'll tell you, I'll tell you, it take a little time to get it straight. Uh, Friday, we got Dr. Uh, Rose coming back on the program, talk about uh, more questions and answers. So y'all can come on in and basically, uh, you know, ask any questions that, that you want. So that, that's how it's going down. So uh, no questions yet, uh, Tanya? You don't see anything on the screen yet? Okay, so um, they're fraud there. Um, so that's basically what I got uh, for today. We're going to have some other guests uh, this week. And thank you, FloridaKeysInjury.com, Dr. Burroughs, Vance Urgent Care. And um, I actually heard today on the news there's a, a, a test that, that tests your uh, saliva, which was pretty interesting. So, you know, it's so much stuff on the news. I want to hear some positive stuff. So in case you don't know me, my name is Louis C. The Mayor. Go to YouTube. Uh, Dot com. Shout out to all my DJs, uh, DJ DOS in uh, New York City. We're covering out there. Uh, he's healthy now, thank God. I got uh, DJ Slice from Philadelphia. Y'all know Stevie B, that Spring Blood, that boy hot on Thursday Night Live on Wild 927. Got DJ Jack, Marathon Dolphins, Willie Gonzalez, Louis Gonzalez, y'all stand up. CO Piscopo, Miami 305, Dade County, stand up. So uh, everybody doing their thing, tune in to uh, the show iHeart. You can go worldwide and check it out. And that's basically what I got. I got Sin Key West, in case you came in late, Service and Industry Key West, trying to make sure that we 
get a handle on what's going on for voters in 2020. It's going to be a serious election. The mayor's up for re-election. Uh, I think one or two more commissioners are up in the city. Uh, county is a serious situation. The tax collector's up. So there's a lot of politics going on. If you can't vote, we got a rule around here uh, on my camp. If you don't vote, please don't talk to me about politics. You can't even go vote. And the best way to vote is absentee. There's no need for you to be in a, in a line for 20 minutes unless you, you want to go over there and you want to go through the process of being in the ballot box. But in Miami, why would you stand in line for three hours when you can mail an absentee ballot and it comes to your house you know, a month ahead of time and all you got to do is put a stamp or put it in a box? That make common sense to you? So y'all need to vote, man. Vote or die. That's what I tell y'all right now. So that's it. My name is Louis C. The Merritt. Thank you, Tanya, on the production. Do big things. We're going to be back on the podcast tomorrow. Tune in to my YouTube channel. Tune in, uh, sorry, tune in to Thursday Night Live Worldwide, Wild 92.7. We going in with that freestyle, that Miami bass, that hip hop, and that new school, man. We, we dropping some hits out there. Shout out to DJ Laz coming through uh, Key Largo, uh, checking in with that boy 305. I miss 305 Pitbull. So, Get the hater blockers out. You know, hate, hating's on pause. You know, we done stop the hating uh, on this situation with the COVID-19 that's on pause. So we love y'all. Have a good evening. Be blessed and be humble. How?